This is the Elite Pacific Properties Luxury Hawaiian Market Update, first quarter 2020. The first quarter of 2020 certainly was cause for some uncertainty. However, much of our data held true to expected trends. We did notice a dip in homes for sale across all of quarter one, with the biggest decline from February to March and an overall decrease of 10% and showing some reaction to the uncertainty of COVID-19's impact. Conversely, we did see an increase in homes sold in the first quarter of 2020 compared to quarter one last year with a 14% overall increase. The largest month over month increase was made in March, signaling that buyers were trying to wrap up deals they were in. One sign that the sellers may be holding off to ride out the pandemic storm and see where the economy is going is we saw a decrease in new listings of 17% compared to quarter one of 2019. On the other hand, we did see a 5.8% increase in listing price from last year. Sellers that do take their home to the market are confident in the value of their properties. Sellers will be happy to hear that we still saw an average of 91% of sellers sell their homes at original list price. While it seems there are still plenty of strong buyers willing and able to close on luxury properties, we did see a 16% increase in days on market, so it's something sellers must be willing to accept and prepare for. That being said, the median list price of luxury Hawaiian properties is still holding strong at $1.39 million, a 1.4% increase over quarter one of 2019. So while we are all taking this global pandemic in stride and keeping ourselves and others safe, quarter one stayed very close to normal. And we feel next quarter might tell a better story of if this will be a blip on the economic radar or signal major change to the market. For more detailed and island-specific luxury market reports, please visit ElitePacific.com.